the non-melanoma skin cancers are oftentimes easier to treat than more advanced melanoma. Basal cell carcinoma is the most common type of skin cancer and the most common malignancy overall. And um, a squamous cell carcinoma is uh, the second most common type of skin cancer. The most common treatment for the non-melanoma skin cancer are destructive modalities, whether that is surgery or a procedure known as electrodesiccation and curettage. As far as surgeries go, the two most common type of surgical techniques for the non-melanoma skin cancers include a procedure known as Mohs micrographic surgery or Mohs surgery uh, or a uh, standard excision. Mohs is a procedure where skin cancer is removed and evaluated microscopically to ensure that the edges are clear of cancer, and if not, uh, an additional layer can be performed until we get to the point where all the margins are clear. A standard excision um, is a procedure where a skin cancer is removed with a standard margin of normal skin around it and typically uh, stitched up immediately afterwards. The main difference is uh, you're not sparing as much tissue. You could potentially be taking more than necessary. And because you're not examining it at the time that you're stitching the patient, there is a possibility that uh, you haven't fully removed everything and the patient might need another procedure afterwards to ensure that everything has been removed. Electrodesiccation and curettage is a procedure where the surface of the skin is scraped off and the base of that scraping is then uh, treated with an electric needle to uh, burn the base. Topical therapy uh, or cream therapy for skin cancers uses uh, one of several different creams to destroy the skin cancer either by topical chemotherapy or a topical immunomodulator. These surgeries and procedures are all outpatient procedures, which essentially means that the patient is treated in an office setting, not in a hospital. Uh, generally, it's a one-day procedure. The procedure is performed and the patient can go home immediately afterwards. Another option that might be offered to a patient to treat their skin cancer is radiation therapy. That is performed by a physician uh, called a radiation oncologist, where uh, radiation is delivered to the skin to destroy the skin cancer. Radiation can have a lot of toxicity to the skin and to uh, organs, so it has to be delivered in a very precise method. As an alternative for somebody that does not want to undergo surgery of the skin, radiation can be discussed with their physician. The great thing about the non-melanoma skin cancers is um, they could be visualized and detected early. The treatments are very low risk. We've come a long way with various procedures, so we could really target the therapy to remove the cancer. Uh, patients could get back on their feet and back to normal um, almost immediately afterwards.